Okay, getting ready for uh, race number seven from Red Shores in Charlottetown tonight. It is the Glenn Taylor Memorial in Vance. A really neat thing. Noah and Annalise McPhee from Peterborough, Ontario, the youngest grandchildren of the late Glenn Taylor, will be in the starting gate for race number seven. How about that tonight, Vance? Oh, that'll be the thrill of a lifetime for them. They're lining up here in the seventh with Hopedale, Paris, Life in the Country, Ocean View, Beamer, All Terrain, Protosper, Walbert, Desired Treasure, Good Morning Kai, and it's post time. They're up and pacing, and from the grandstand side, Good Morning Kai firing out towards the rail, Protosper between them. That is Desired Treasure. Good Morning Kai got a little fancy stepping there as they round the turn and go to the back stretch, led by Protosper and Murder. Second, that's Desired Treasure. Good Morning Kai looks for a spot towards the rail, and there it is, third. Racing fourth is all terrain, then in fifth, that is Hopedale Perez racing from six. On past that opening quarter mile is life in the country. Then from seventh towards the inside Ocean View Beamer and Walbert on the outside. 28 and four was the opening quarter. They swing off the turn for time one. Protest Spurs, a fraction center. The backfield, they're well in motion now. Racing second towards the rail, Desired Treasure. First up on the outside, third is All Terrain. Good morning, Kai at the rail, fourth. Moving up second over fifth is Oakdale Paris. Six up the rail is Ocean View Beamer. Life in the country on the outside, seventh. On the rail, the trailer. That's Walbert. 58 and 3 was the half. To the back stretch they go. At the rail, Prontus Purr from the outside. All terrain now to take over. Coming third on the outside is Oakdale Paris. Fourth on the rail as they arrive at the three quarters. Desired treasure. Moving up fifth from the outside as they go by the three quarters. Live in the country. Good morning, Kai Six. Ocean View Beamer seventh. And the trailer. That's Walbert. 129 and two was the three quarters. They're in a bunch and they're in the home stretch. All terrain at the rail. Hopedale Paris on the outside. Way wide life in the country. Farther wide, Ocean View Beamer. Good morning, Kai, between them. All terrain will win. Tight for the deuce, desired treasure. Up against Hopedale Paris. Two minutes and 01 fifth. Okay, we talked about this horse in the pre-race, Kenny, here. It is the Glenn Taylor Memorial. We'll see the trackside presentation. We talked about all-terrain in his back class. He had 40 lifetime wins. Pride of Spur, one at the front end uh, here tonight. He got there, and uh, it forced all-terrain to come first up, but uh, he had lots of horse tonight. All-terrain had to be used pretty hard here out of the four-hole first up and driving, cleared the lead, and held off an onslaught of challengers here. So a game, game effort, and as you mentioned, 40 victories coming in, 41 right here, is second of the season. Back down to a cozy uh, condition here was all terrain, showing his class here with Corey McPherson for Trevor Hicken and Lee Hicken, and the battle's on for second. Diving to the inside was the seven, desired treasure, and closing hard was Hopedale Paris in the uh, battle for the play spot here. Yep, four, seven, one, the try in the seventh at Red Shores.
Into the seventh race, winner's circle is four all terrain. Bay facing gelding nine by tell all. From the dragon again, Dam Tura Hanover, owned by Lee Hicken of Charlottetown, trained by Trevor Hicken. Corey McPherson, the winning driver, the mile in two minutes and one fifth. This is a special victory for Corey McPherson tonight. It's the Glenn Taylor Memorial with the trackside presentation.